It's a rotary drill though. That's like a giant hydraulic hammer. There's these claws, see that? It's a giant drill bit, you guys, that drills hundreds of feet into the earth to access water that's way down deep in the earth. The truck weighs 60,000 pounds, you guys. That's as much as five full-grown elephants. Well, it looks like this mouse died and the other mouse started eating it. A frog? Yeah, isn't that pretty? Look, it's green and brown. Wouldn't that be cool if we could work it? Axel's getting inside the excavator. Hopefully those claws don't close on you. Look at this dozer. Can get in it? Yeah, get in. <laughs> pretty sweet. This thing is kind of old. It's small, isn't it? It's so cute. Wouldn't that be cool if we could work it? They use this dozer here, you guys, to put us a new road in here. This right here, Axel, is a rotary drill. Yeah, it, it does bore into the earth. It's a rotary drill, though. That's like a giant hammer right there. It's a hydraulic hammer, and this thing spins, and then at the end of this right here, there's these, ah, uh, see that right there? See that? There's these claws, see that? It's a giant drill bit, you guys, that drills hundreds of feet into the earth to access water that's way down deep in the earth. It's gonna have to drill like only the length of that. Why? Because there's a stream. Because there's a stream close by? There's a stream of water running over here. Come on, let's go have a look at it. So what do we have here, bro? Our stream? Yeah, so Axel was saying, you guys, that we won't have to drill that far down for our well that we're drilling with that truck because there's water running along right here. But do you know what this is called, I'm Axel? I'm trying to make a dam right there. Yeah, this is a stream, Axel. Why would we drill down with that drill right there to get water if we just got water running right here? The reason we can't just get water from here and drink it is because it's not safe because like right up there could be a raccoon pooping in the water or an elk or a deer. Um, or there's bacteria that thrive, right? We can't drink it because of that, yeah. So we gotta drill who knows how far down to get water that's safe to drink. And you can't just drill down uh, 10 feet because the water is still contaminated down that far. You gotta drill at least like 40, 50 feet down, something like that, until we hit bedrock. And that's where we hit water that's been filtered for years potentially before it gets to be safe where we can drink it. Mm-hmm. And then we can drink it just straight out of the ground? Yeah. Uh-huh. Really? Yeah. Without having to cook it? Yeah, without having to boil it. You guys, last year we had to boil this water. You guys may remember that video we made where we had to collect water from this stream right here and then boil it to drink it. So we get the water from the source right here just about, and then we boil it to make sure dangerous bacteria die. So we just put the jug down here like this and catch water in it. We don't have to do that anymore because we're gonna be getting a well drilled right now. We're gonna show you guys how they drill this well. They already started drilling with this truck, you guys, but now they're going to get some water with it. They got another big truck, a water truck. In the meantime, we're gonna look at this. Axel's getting inside the excavator. We got this excavator here, you guys. You guys may remember this excavator from last year whenever we were getting our foundation put in, a gravel foundation. Hopefully those claws don't close on you. <laughs> no, they won't. This thing is off and the key is gone. <laughs> you can't even get inside, I don't think. Let's see. Let's see if we can get inside. Nope, they locked it. Can't get in. All right, well, we're gonna sit here and wait for the water truck to get here. Truck's here. All right, you guys, they're here with the truck. Now they're gonna start drilling down into the ground. Each piece of pipe here that they drill down into the ground is 20 foot long. So how do you think they get uh, up to 300, 600 feet in the ground? They, they drill down 20 feet and they put another piece of pipe on top of that and drill down another 20 feet and they just keep going like that till they get where they need to go, which is bedrock. You know what that orange thing is? What? 
It's a level. The truck has to be level. Otherwise, if they're drilling, they'll drill sideways instead of straight down. We want to go straight down. Oh, look at that. Hey, wheels are lifted up. Yeah. You guys, these wheels are off of the ground here. And that's because it needs to be level. In order for it to be level and stabilized, the wheels have to be off the ground there. And then these things right here are what's holding the truck up right now. They're about to start drilling here. They got a, a wench here. Kind of like a crane. Look, they're hooking it on, bro. See this? Look at that, Axel. truck weigh? The truck weighs 60,000 pounds, you guys. That's as much as one, two, three, four, five full-grown elephants. this you guys this mouse got his face eaten this mouse is alive yeah I think mm. he's standing up and he doesn't have any cut let's see nope he's dead well it looks like this mouse died and the other mouse started eating it and then he died hmm that's gross found something a frog? Yeah, isn't that pretty? Look, it's green and brown. Can I hold it? Yeah, it beats very gentle. Yeah. Look what we found on mommy. So, oh, that's beautiful. So we figured out what this is, you guys. It's a Pacific tree frog. Wait. Whoa. It's a Pacific tree frog. <laughs> I'm showing you it. Oh, uh, yeah, look how it's gripping onto your hands. That's here. its See? stickers. Yeah, it's, it's I want little to see fingers that See if you can stick onto you. All right, you guys, so. They aren't finished drilling the well, it's gonna be a while. Yeah. We're back here at home right now with Axel's friends, and we got all of the Legos here, and they are gonna be building some really cool, my own creations with these Legos, right? We have tons of Legos, look at all the Legos. All these Legos from Hawaii, you guys, and oh my goodness, look at this. All these Legos that we left here in Washington. We are back and we have them. Look, uh, look, it's the dozer, bro. So Axel's building a castle here. Wait. And what are you building? I'm building a two boat that are gonna be attached together with a merge. Ah, okay. That is awesome, man. Are you gonna float uh, it in the pond outside? Yeah. And what are you building? I'm building the car. You're building the car? A race car. Ah, okay, a race car. Mm -hmm. What are you building? I'm making a boat. You're making a boat. Are you gonna float in the pond outside too? Sweet. All right, you guys, we'll be right back and we'll see what they build, okay? Oh my gosh, you guys, they are finished with their boats. That is so cool. Ah, mine's heading for... Look out. 
there's gonna be a crash. <laughs> oh man, that is so cool. It's like a little uh, natural landscape on the police boat. That is awesome. And then that one right there is cool. It's got it's two boats put together and it has these one of those like kayaks, life rafts, basically on the side. Look out, they're gonna crash! Oh no! My guy's turning cola! Boom! And so yours also has that arm on the back, right? Uh-huh. It's got the grapple arm. That came off of the tractor, didn't it? That is an awesome creation. Mine's gonna be a motorboat coming for Kodas! No, don't do that, Ezra! No! <laughs> so, you didn't quite get your castle finished, right? So you started building a boat now. <laughs> Were you just playing? Axel stopped building Legos. He just started playing. <laughs> Sometimes you get bored of doing things like building Legos. You just want to play, right? But now, since they're floating their boats out there, Axel wants to make his own ship real quick. So he's just going to do a simple little ship here, putting some little blades on the side of this Lego fireboat ship. That was a really fun show to make, that fireboat show. All right, you guys, Axel's finished with his ship, and it is a flying boat ship. <laughs> that is awesome, bro. Hello. <laughs> well, you guys made some awesome chips. Can you give me five? Way to use your imagination. Those are so cool. Give me five, bro. Give me five. Nice work, man. Give me five. Oh, there you go. All right, you guys. We had so much fun watching this awesome, awesome well truck starting to drill our well. And we'll let you guys know whenever it gets finished and we'll show it to you guys, okay? Will you guys get out and use your imaginations to find creative ways to live your life and love everyone around you? No matter what you have, no matter where you are, you can have fun and enjoy your life just like you see us doing every day if you just use your imagination. We'll see you later. Bye!